My name is Officer Ryan Fuentes. I'm a motor officer for the city of Fairfield. Currently we have five assigned motor officers and one assigned motor sergeant. Initially I wanted to become a police officer because I wanted to engage in a community and really affect some form of change. I wanted to be a positive role model for children who don't necessarily have a positive role model to look up to. I started noticing that I saw the most change within my community during traffic enforcement with educating the community and being somebody they could visibly see out on the roadways. And that's why I decided to move towards traffic as my full-time position here versus patrol. I have never been on a motorcycle until this position. However, I did grow up um, riding ATVs and dirt bikes, but not any street motorcycles. This is a first for me. We have to have a little bit thicker skin. Uh, we engage with all types of members of the community, and we have to be able to adapt to every single person that we encounter. We have to engage with them and understand their situations and, and listen more. We're not just handling a call for service where we're responding to somebody's worst time in need. Uh, we're engaging people who are on their way to the grocery store or have been, you know, possibly coming from soccer practice. Being a motor officer, you have to be more aware of what's going on around you at all times. We don't have the protection of a vehicle and the community doesn't see us as well. It's definitely more dangerous to be on this motorcycle than in a police car. What I love about Fairfield is the community support. We have such a huge community support here that allows us to do our job and the people here are really great. Everyone I come in contact with is always so supportive and uplifting, and it, they always encourage me to do my job to the best of my abilities. To be the first female motor for the city of Fairfield is quite an honor. I honestly didn't realize I was the first female motor until it happened, but I've gotten so much support and encouragement from those around me that it just puts me in a place where I know I'm gonna succeed. I'm putting my stamp on something here in the city and I'm really pushing myself to set a mark and a benchmark for those around me um, and to encourage other female officers within the community or those around me to reach for goals within their communities that may be something they didn't think they could reach or go for or has been a staple for, for others. For me, my goals with my career are to take it one day at a time. I try to um, learn something new every day and push myself outside of my comfort zone every day. And at this point in my career, I'm focusing on being a motor and being the best motor officer that I can be and learning as much as I possibly can.